Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'll be explaining to you guys how you can record a Google Slide presentation on Zoom. So let's get right into it. Now, uh, you cannot use Zoom directly to uh, record only a PowerPoint presentation. However, you can use Zoom to record a meeting you have in it. Now you can have a solo meeting, which you can easily then record uh, with yourself. However, whatever you choose to do, you can even add, uh, you know, a Google presentation or Google Slides presentation with a meeting with other participants and you can record that entire meeting. So what you need to do is just enter Google Slides, start presenting and when you're in a Zoom call then you need to use Zoom's own recording software which is used within Zoom as well. Now once you open up your Zoom account you just need to navigate to your settings menu and select recordings to ensure that local recording is switched on. Then you need to navigate to your home screen and launch a call by clicking new meeting and if prompted just join with computer audio and or choose another microphone then you need to import and uh, open any presentation materials you'll need such as slides or images and you can easily share the presentation uh, through share screen uh, as i've said since we're doing this in google slides you will share the screen of the google slides presentation on the relevant tab and that's pretty much it then you need to make sure you're unmuted and then uh, your webcam is switched on if you want and then select the start video from the bar menu at the bottom uh, of your screen and that should start recording then you need to ensure uh, everything you have is ready. And when you're ready, just select record from the bar and it'll start recording very easily. Uh, you can choose whether it is a local recording on your computer uh, and or you can just uh, record it to the cloud or to your Zoom account. And then once you start your presentation, just go over it. And once you're done recording, you just click stop recording and then locate your meeting. And that's pretty much it. You can then edit it however you would like, but that is pretty much all there is to it. Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll be seeing you guys in another video.